Hey guys, welcome back to the King Tutorial class. In today's class, we'll be looking at adding and subtracting logarithm of numbers less than 1. As our last class, we looked at how we found the characteristics of numbers less than 1. Okay, now, just like in our normal addition and subtraction, let's say we're going to add numbers less than 1 in logarithm. Now, 4 plus 3 here gives us 7. 6 plus 1 gives us 7. 0 plus 0 gives us 0. 1 plus 2 gives us 3. Bar 2 plus bar 1 gives us what? Bar 3. Because bar 2 there represents minus 2. Bar 1 there represents minus 1. Therefore, minus 2 plus minus 1 gives us what? Minus 3. Now, let's do for number 3 now, which is also addition. 4 plus 5 there gives us 9. 6 plus 3 gives us 9. 2 plus 9 gives us 11. 1, remember 1. 1 plus 3 plus 1 gives us what? 5. Then bar 1 plus bar 1 gives us what? Bar 2. Now for the case of subtraction, let's see. 0 minus 0 gives us 0. 1 cannot subtract 8. So I borrow 1 from 1. It remains 0. This becomes what? 11. 11 minus 8 here gives us 3. 0 minus 0, 0. 4 minus 3, 1. Point. Minus 3 minus minus 2. That's minus 3 plus 2, which gives us what? Minus 1. In log them, it is written as what? Bar 1. Now for number 4, I cannot um, subtract 5 from 3. So what will I do? I'll borrow 1 from this point. This remains 0. The one I borrow becomes 10 here. Borrow 1 again, this becomes 9. Because this is what I'm going to put it here, it becomes 10. Borrow 1, becomes 9. Put it here, becomes what? 13. 8 minus 5 leaves us with what? 8. 9 minus 1 leaves us with what? 8. Okay. 9 minus 2 leaves us with what? 7. 0 cannot subtract it. So I would borrow 1 from minus 4. If I borrow 1 from minus 4, it's as though saying minus 1, minus 4. So I borrow 1 here. This becomes what? Minus 5. Or by 5. Now that becomes 1 here. 10 minus 8 gives us what? 2. Point. Bar 3 minus, I mean, bar 5 minus bar 3. That's minus 5 plus 3. That's minus what? 2 or bar 2. So, that has to solve questions in um, additional subtraction of logarithm less than 1.